American Notes for General Circulation by Charles Dickens is a captivating travelogue that provides a detailed account of Dickens' experiences during his journey to the United States in 1842. Through his astute observations and vivid descriptions, Dickens offers readers a profound insight into the social, cultural, and political landscape of America during that time. One of the central themes explored in the book is Dickens' critique of various aspects of American society, particularly slavery, and the treatment of Native Americans. Dickens' vehement opposition to slavery is evident throughout the narrative, as he condemns the institution in no uncertain terms. He describes the deplorable conditions endured by enslaved people and denounces the hypocrisy of a nation that prides itself on freedom while perpetuating such egregious injustice. Dickens' moral outrage is palpable as he exposes the inherent cruelty and inhumanity of slavery, urging his readers to confront the moral implications of this abhorrent practice. Furthermore, Dickens sheds light on the plight of Native Americans, highlighting the injustices they faced at the hands of European settlers. He criticizes the government's policies of displacement and forced assimilation, which resulted in the marginalization and suffering of indigenous communities. Dickens' portrayal of Native Americans as victims of colonial oppression underscores his commitment to social justice and his disdain for imperialism and cultural hegemony. In addition to his social commentary, Dickens offers a nuanced portrayal of American society, capturing both its vibrant energy and its underlying contradictions. He marvels at the dynamism of American cities like New York and Philadelphia, with their bustling streets and bustling commerce, yet he also laments the pervasive materialism and moral degradation that he perceives as endemic to American culture. Dickens' juxtaposition of the nation's prosperity with its moral bankruptcy serves as a cautionary tale about the pitfalls of unchecked capitalism and the corrosive effects of greed and corruption. Moreover, Dickens provides insightful commentary on the character of the American people, offering a mix of admiration and criticism. He admires their spirit of enterprise and their commitment to democratic ideals, yet he also admonishes their propensity for arrogance and self-righteousness. Dickens' observations are characterized by a keen sense of irony and wit, as he exposes the contradictions and absurdities inherent in American life. Throughout the narrative, Dickens employs vivid imagery and evocative language to bring his experiences to life. His descriptions are rich in detail, engaging the reader's senses and immersing them in the sights, sounds, and smells of the places he visits. Whether he is recounting his encounters with fellow travelers, describing the natural beauty of the American landscape, or depicting the squalor of urban slums, Dickens' prose is imbued with a vividness and immediacy that captivates the reader's imagination. In conclusion, American Notes for General Circulation is a compelling work that offers a multifaceted portrait of antebellum America. Through his incisive commentary and vivid storytelling, Charles Dickens provides readers with a thought-provoking exploration of the social, cultural, and political dynamics of the young nation. His critique of slavery, his examination of Native American rights, and his portrayal of American society all serve to illuminate the complexities of the American experience and underscore the enduring relevance of Dickens' insights.